hi guys welcome back to my channel Pisces illustrations if you are new here please do not forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the like button comment down below and share today's video is sponsored by me Pisces illustrations <laughs> if you guys want stickers prints backpacks skateboard decks snowboard decks tarot cards playing cards you can find them on my website at PiscesIllustrations.com. I am still working on getting more product onto the website, so you guys stay tuned. So, in today's video, I am going to be participating in the Draw This In Your Style Challenge. And yeah, for those of you who don't know what this challenge is, it's a challenge that I think became popular on Instagram, um, more so than YouTube. But yeah, it's a challenge that a content creator would create some art and then ask other artists to, they would ask other artists to recreate their art piece in their particular style. So that's what I'm doing today and also, I wanted to talk about my experience um, on three different occasions. Two that actually happened on one day, but my experiences with certain fast food restaurants. So yeah, um, so the artist piece that I will be recreating today is by um, Kale Illustrations. Chael? Chael Illustrations? I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing it. I'm not exactly sure, but you'll see the name on the screen. And I just thought this was um, an amazing piece to recreate myself. I really like the colors and how fun this um, particular art piece was. So, yeah. So, yeah, just kind of getting into the commentary. All right. So, the story one. I remember one day I was kind of craving some pizza, even though I'm supposed to be um, cleaning up my diet, which I am doing right now. But I was kind of craving some pizza. And I thought to myself, hmm, what should I get? What should I get? What should I get? Or who should I order from? Let's see. Um, so I was like, I really don't want any Little Caesars, even though they're cheaper. And, um, yeah, I just didn't want Little Caesars that day. So I was like, okay, maybe Pizza Hut. But I know how terrible their customer service is, especially where I live. And, yeah, I decided to call them up anyway. So I get on the phone and I start talking to some lady with an attitude. Um, she asked me what did I want and I'm like, hmm, okay, that's not how you talk to customers. But I'm like, I don't want nobody speaking in my food or doing anything crazy to my pizza. So, you know, I was just uh, on my best behavior on the phone and I told her I wanted a large pizza and she acted like she couldn't hear me. She's like, what? I'm like a large pizza and she was like is that it and yeah that that's it lady that's it she told me it'll be ready in like 15 minutes and i was like oh i wanted it to, uh i wanted to get it delivered to my house and she just it was silent on the phone and i was like hello and she hung up i was like all right so i was thinking i'm like okay just the rudest people ever and i would never go back to that pizza hut ever again and um I had a, feel, a funny feeling that uh, my order was not going to be placed. Oh, I forgot. She did X the name on the ticket, and I gave her my last name. And um, I had a funny feeling throughout the course of me waiting to go get my pizza that she just didn't take the order, or she didn't write it down, or they weren't going to prepare it. So I wait, and then I head up to Pizza Hut, because it's literally like a minute up the street from me. And I get in line. It's kind of a long line, and I wait there for like 10 minutes. Well, it's not a long line, but, you know, the wait was uh, annoying. 10 minutes in line is long enough. And then I get up to the window, and I tell her uh, my last name. This lady, she's looking for the order, like, mind you, I don't know if this is the lady I was talking to on the phone or not. Maybe, maybe not. And she says she doesn't see my order. And I just, I'm like, you know what, don't worry about it, and I drive off. <laughs> I was like, I would never order 
from that pizza ever again. Matter of fact, I'm not even supposed to be eating pizza anyway. So, but I still want pizza at this point in time. So, I mosey over to Little Caesars. Why did I do that? These people have consistently been rude, no matter who they bring inside of the establishment. Because, you know, every time I go, it's, it's different people. The customer service is just terrible. Their attitudes are deplorable. But I still went anyway because I really want the pizza. So I get there and I guess this lady, um, overweight lady, she kind of races me to, to the door. I'm like kind of halfway paying attention. I'm like, okay, she really wants this pizza. So um, we get inside and we have to still stay like six feet apart. Yeah, like a few minutes pass. I see how the cashiers kind of treat the other customers, and I'm just like, oh my god. It's like, I really want this pizza, otherwise I would just walk out. We're waiting for the pizza, and the lady that raced me to the door, he's just kind of eyeballing me up and down, and I'm like, I know I look uh, a hot mess right now. I didn't plan to get out, okay? I was just going to go to pick up a pizza from Pizza Hut, but it wasn't there. And I'm kind of thinking, I'm like, she has the audacity to kind of be like, scoping me out when she looks like trash herself this bad weave on her head anyway she orders her pizza and then i'm next in line to order mine again these um cashiers uh i just i don't know the mindset of some of these people i don't know where it comes from exactly i'm like if you don't like your job don't work there get another job like it's not that freaking hard we don't have to work at a fast food restaurant. I know I will never go back to working at a fast food restaurant, you know. So anyway, I order my cheats pizza and you know how Little Caesars is. They already have like ready-made pizza sometimes. And um, she hands me the pizza. And something tells me, like I walk out the door. I get the pizza, you know, I pay for it. I get the pizza and I walk out the door and something tells me to look at the pizza. I open the box and I see like just this crusty weird nightmarish pizza and I'm like uh-uh no 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 so I walk back into the store and um I'm like ma'am I need another pizza this is just look at this this is deplorable so she has an attitude and she throws the pizza away and she gets you know the people in the back to make another pizza so I'm waiting for my other pizza and once I get it she doesn't say have a nice day or anything. Of course, people lack manners in certain parts. So, I just eat my pizza and bounce. And then I said to myself, I would never ever go back to that place either. It's just where I live, um, people's attitudes. God, like, I don't understand. all I have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed my rant on fast food workers. Um, you can comment down below in the comment section. Let me know your experience with, you know, a nasty, rude fast food employees if you have any. And yeah, don't forget to share this video. Please share it so, you know, other people can see it. Please like it, you know. Help boost my chances of other people seeing my channel. And yeah, 
Oh, you can follow me on all of my social media. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.